Hey everybody, welcome back to E4 Art of War multiplayer featuring myself, Northern Line, as well as Mathis, Arumba, and Quill. Say hello. 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 Hey there. There we go. Alright, okay. let's do this. I agree. Leroy. Jenkins. That's Who's what I think. Every guy? every every time somebody says let's do this. Yeah. I can't I cannot help it. It's a, it's a thing in my head it's stuck. One of the first and dankest memes on the internet. I don't think it was one of the first. No way. Not even close. Couldn't possibly be. Actually, I guess we'll leave it at that. But it's pretty compelling. It even gets people. Like, people don't know where it's from. They don't know it's WoW. Yep. Turned into commercial. You can get crazy. a Lero Jenkins uh, follower now in Warlords of Draenor. Yes. <laughs> yes, you can. It's a great little quest tour. We're not even a quest, more like a dungeon challenge. Dun, 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 dun. So I might have one little war. Just a way for a thin war. <laughs> finally, Brunei, I'm finally in a position where I could justify a trade conflict with them. Brunei, who are I've they? been waiting forever. They're off the coast. I have like no shared uh, sea borders with them. Because they don't actually have a uh, Pontianak. Oh, they're way far away, yeah. Yeah. The only way I could get any sort of CB is if they got enough trade power. Like, if they got above, I think, 10% trade power in a node where I had at least 20% or however it works, then I could justify a trade conflict. So, it's it's finally happened that I've noticed. So, I'm justifying it and I'll get a CB. Nice. And I'll go and smoosh them a little. I'm going to go Introduce above my them to the uh, Ayutaya way of life. Ayutaya. Yep. Yeah, okay. Mutapa has a two-star general, I bet. <laughs> Very strong military tradition. <laughs> you don't even know, man. Did they have the thing where your trade fleets will merge? Yes, that in they 1. did. 9? Lovely. Mm -hmm. Well, they'll merge by themselves now? If they're in the same node. Awesome. That's actually really good. Yeah, that's one of those things where it's like, it's a really nice quality of life. I can see why... It would be kind of maybe a pain in the ass to uh, to work out the merging logic. Mm -hmm. Like it's a non-trivial programming problem. It's not super hard, but it's like it's not the same as like making a I don't know one of our many other time-saving UI requests we've put in. <laughs> right. But you're like, no, that's so minor. You got to do that. It's ridiculous. It's not in the game. Mm hmm. All right. Time to bump up my army maintenance. Well, my uh, col my colonial nation likes me now enough. That I can actually enforce peace if I need to. <laughs> they didn't like you enough. <laughs> no, <laughs> I, I ignored. I ignored them. I didn't ever. I never improved relations with them. So they were like a negative ninety war score, and their opinion of me was fifty. <laughs> <laughs> Can't enforce demands or enforce peace. I can enforce. Oh, they, uh, I can enforce peace between you and Mutapa, Brian. What do you mean? I don't know, the options there for some reason. I can click enforce peace, enforce a white peace between the target country and one of its enemies. So you and Mutapa. Yeah. Yeah, I can. That's I really can random. That too. How come? How come I can do that? I'm so far away. Why is that something I can do? Mm, Powerful question, man. Well, you border Ethiopia. Yes. Oh, you're right. I forgot that. That technically we're bordering. God damn, Mathis, you got so scary. Did when did this happen? Did you abandon your colony, Arumba? No, damn natives oh, <laughs> killed yeah. it. I know. I know how that is. Do you? <laughs> you have colonies? I've had colonies before. Have, have you been trying to colonize We're Africa? all the <laughs> sons of colonists. <laughs> okay. I think things are finally stabilizing enough that I can maybe do something fun. Ethiopia? There's Sinai no high is really big on the map. There's no fun in... Uh... Muggles beating beating up on a target like that. What was that, Quill? Yeah, the Muggle font is the biggest out of all the players, though. It's Muggles, then Songhai. Songhai stretches more, but the Muggles is technically a higher font size. Not quite as big as the Oirites, but out of the players? Do we know who the big guns are? No, you don't. They tell us Saint. hot chocolate. Oh. Sweet. Hot right? That's the stripping song from... Uh, Full, uh, full Monty, oh hot chocolate. God, I'm an idiot. I forgot. <laughs> or is that fucking... the name of the band? 
Yeah. It's, so uh, you're thinking of the song Hot Blooded by Foreigner. I think. Yeah, that's what I'm singing. You're right. But right. what's oh, the stripping okay. song from the Full Monty? It's Hot Chocolate, isn't it? I don't know. My parents didn't let me watch that movie yeah. when it came out because it was about male strippers. <laughs> I was like nine. Yeah, but they're not at all attractive, so it's fine. Forgot to re-raise my army maintenance before engaging oh that. Oh my <sighs> god. <laughs> uh... Oh, it's You Sexy Thing by Hot Chocolate. Ah. All right. Yeah. We are... Believe in miracles. Ah, there we go. It's the one from this. all those commercials for snack foods. Seems like a very strange uh, amalgam there. It's always like a Cheeto flying through the air. Ladies like the snack food. <laughs> what? Where did you come from, Mutapa Mutapins? <laughs> what? The Mutapins just came from like across the desert here. Back into their country. I didn't even didn't know they existed. My war goal for the trade thing is blockade ports. I guess that makes perfect sense, of course. I don't think I've done a trade conflict before. But that totally makes sense. Yeah, okay. Okay. Mm. Fuck. Why do I have two generals? Where'd this guy come from? You probably hired him. I didn't. <laughs> I promise I know that much. He's no, I think you did. Big scary pop up. How could you possibly uh, do it by also, accident? How did my force limit just You're drop about to spend. Fifty military points. Are you sure? <laughs> I, I was. Now I'm not. <laughs> now, uh, what? How could you possibly be rising up? There's like no unrest. Nah, uh, there's a little unrest. War exhaustion. A sous-son. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I forgot that I have been at war forever. I mean, I've been complaining about it for half as long, so I should know. The man looks are too afraid to help me with anything. Little chickens. <laughs> oh, hey, um, Mutapa likes me enough now that I can enforce peace. <laughs> Every comment from uh, you or Mathis in my ears is just, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, Ethiopia. <laughs> fuck you. I Ethiopia's actually, had it way too easy. Yeah, I right? Actually, I can't actually do anything, though. <laughs> what am I going to uh, do? I mean, it's, it's either attack you or attack other people that uh, it's questionable how well I do against them. Yeah, don't challenge yourself. I mean, <laughs> played the played the game in, for in strategy. In strategy games, you hours. Should, in strategy, you should always attack the weakest person, the person that you get stand to gain the most from. You do it, it's AI. This is correct. Yes, Morocco. All right, have fun. You can get your vassal back. You're scared about going to war against Morocco and Tunis. That was what oh, all great. this bluster was about? Great. France is colonizing now. No, it, they have tech 14. They have superior tech than I, than I do. I want you to we're going to zoom out on the map. And I want to have someone overlay that quote on the bottom. <laughs> and then you can highlight Morocco and Songhai. <laughs> so that people know what they're looking at. I could use a couple extra blockaders, maybe to speed that up. Yeah, it's fine. Nah, you're not gonna revolt. Okay. Yes, they are. <clears throat> oh, yes, Did you just they lose are. A bunch of troops there, Mathis. I disband a couple troops. Yeah. 
Because I just completed my quest to have an army bigger uh -huh. than yours. And I did not build any new troops. Now I got rid of uh, whatever mercs I still had sitting around in my army. I have a mission to make Ethiopia's opinion of me at least 125. Because rival of rival. Well, we'll declare war on Arumba, and at least uh, for me personally, you'll get there. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Fighting this tactics disadvantage is not fun. Oh, uh, losing a lot of extra dudes? Mm-hmm. I don't feel like westernizing really helped me that much. At least not yet. Uh, they're too big to vassalize. Cool. That's all right. As long as I've got a foothold on Brunei for subsequent wars, I'm going to be totally okay with that. That is all my mercs gone. Okay, good. So it's not playing right now, but I have started getting Christmas music in the game. Oh, did you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. At the full fa la 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 going on. <laughs> good times. Have you ever listened to the, the music carefully? <laughs> I, I did it once, but I couldn't remember now. They have pretty funny lyrics. It's like, you know, something about Cassus Belly and declaring war on people, and all the lyrics are different. It's not just regular Christmas music. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I, you pick up the words, even if you're not paying attention, you still note it, and you're like, wait, did they just say... <laughs> <laughs> Uzbeks? Really? Oh, yeah, I did take a bunch of shit from you. Fair enough. What do they, they want? They just entered the coalition against me. Wow. I mean, they're kind of a non-player. Like, they're not they're a non-issue there, but I'm still kind of annoyed. non-player, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I still have 65 AU with them. All right. Whatever, man, I have a bigger army than the, uh, the Muggles. Fear, Fear me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Everybody's quiet. Yeah. Yeah. Just, um, just war. Just fight. trying to make my way in the world. <laughs> just trying to hard time hold, over there. Hold it together. Stay on target. <laughs> Hmm. I may be lucky again and lucky enough again to get to 100% religious unity, which is very oh, surprising wow. to me. Very nice. It's a small victory, but you got to take what you can get. I need one of these uh, sieges to finish so that my ships are no longer getting attrition at sea. Ah! Just lost a ship. Another. What the? F Oh, because they decide to walk through the South China Sea instead of following the coast. <laughs> Son of a bitch! <sighs> I guess I should have shift-clicked the safe route for them. It is your own fault, clearly. Or left them in the coast of Brunei. Yeah, I forgot my sailors were all suicidal. <laughs> nice peaceful war. Just a fun little, a little tease. <laughs> <laughs> you just call it a peaceful war? Yeah, just easy. Nice little peaceful war. It's right. against one country with no friends. <laughs> it reminds me of changing the adjective of your country in Crusader Kings 2 so you can declare peaceful wars. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. Oh, that's that. funny. Just a nice Sunday mm. afternoon war. <laughs> Short, victorious war. Be home before Christmas. Oh my god. I miss CK2. I need to go back and play that at some point. There's a new expansion coming out, right? A call times. Very soon? Decline. Hey, what is this all about? Where are you getting called to arms from? Apparently, no, not anymore. I'm not. Because I wasn't aware I was even allied to them. And I'm not anymore. Who was it? Uh, the Ottomans? <laughs> oh, oh. You're allied to the Ottomans? Apparently. Not anymore. I'm wow. Not. Wow. What? The truth comes out. The the number one power in the game. You I didn't allied. know I was allied to them. Oh, I didn't know I was allied Son to Portugal and Spain simultaneously either. That might have, that, that, that is not something I did. I promise <laughs> you that. So it might have come with the muggles. 
They might have been allied I as I started. Be and so what? That's like Scumbag two weeks. Mathis. Yeah, two weeks what, you've been allied to him then? Yeah, but the Ottomans have never called me into a war until now. Yeah, but they did oh. join your wars. No, they did not. Still, it I would have noticed what people do. I don't know oh, about this one, guys. What a scumbag. Uh, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. We're not allies anymore, so don't worry about it. I think Who now, are they going to war with? Now you have to choose another country. <laughs> you have to be Kara Kayunlu now. What you have to do right now is just <laughs> declare war on the Ottomans. It's the I'll, only I'll, thing that's fair. That's the, that's the punishment if you uh, accidentally ally someone who's too strong. You have to go to war I with them. I didn't ally them. <laughs> I probably came with an ally. Let's see. We've what heard your is. side of the story, Mathis. Now let's have all of us who have no familiarity with it come up with our uh, judgments. Oh my God! They have a hundred thousand men. No. Are you implying that our our comments are not rooted in truth? Maybe. Right. <laughs> you think someone would just do that? Lie on the internet? <laughs> what religion are these guys? Sunni. So yeah, if I take just one province, I could then come back in five years as a holy war. Save myself tons of Diplo points. They're still not going to have any friends. So Ottomans just declared war on the Mamluks, Najd, Shamar, yes. Hejaz, yes. Lemsin, Fezin, Songhai. Oh, you're oh. fucked. Yes. Songhai. Song yeah. <laughs> that sucks for... Uh, all right. Yeah, Algiers, okay. Fez, Tafslat, Makuria, and Songlo. I don't uh, think it's actually going to have any impact on Songhai. <laughs> Songlo. No? Yeah. It was a defensive call to arms, so... I think you're just going to stay out of it. They're going to kick the butt out of the, the Mumluks, and then that'll be the end of the war. Yeah, if they want to come sense. all the way down into Africa, I welcome them. Down in Africa. If they ask for military access, I'm going to give it to them. You should, technically, yeah, just do it. Why... How can you be revolting? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> they want independence, man. Oh, no, they are still being converted. Okay, that, they still, that does make sense. They are still at war with Portugal. Jesus. We're actually winning the war against the Ottomans. Or no, we're not. We're losing. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking at the other war that I, that I have going on right now. This is going to be the longest Portugal war ever. Man, I hope the Ottomans... I, I don't care if they poop on you. I don't think they're going to get down there. But I hope they break the treaty between the Mamluks and Hayes. Hedges. Or at least just destroy the Mamluks in general. If I feel like they're just going to abs yeah. absorb them. If they destroyed the Mamluks, I would love to... Uh, I would love to fabricate some claims or something on uh, Hedges and get some territory that's a little bit harder for a Roomba to siege. Mm-hmm. Oh, I guess I could take enough to like vassalize in a subsequent war. Here's That's here's the position smarter. that my game is in right now. I just used a diplomat for the first time this week. Oh. I'm terrible at using diplomats, honestly. I can't ally anybody because they're all different religions, or they're uh, the the few who are the same religion as me are too powerful uh, or too far away. So it's just, and uh, there's no reason to fabricate claims because I've just been warring with people who you know were previously part of my country anyway. Plus, I have religious ideas, and everyone around me is a different religion. In a way, I guess it's a good thing. Sort of. Core this. Your coring range is like your colonial range, right? Yeah. Sounds about right. Oh, son of a bitch. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm still paying off debt from who knows what. Probably from supporting rebels. <laughs> <laughs> you wasted my money with that kind of reckless abandon? It's the dirtiest, oh, yeah. most awesome thing. War reparations so you can support rebels. Makes me laugh every time I think about it. Oh, Ethiopia, your name got funky. Oh, you, what, did it? oh yeah, now it, oh, yeah. Hey, I, I kind of like that. That's Ethiopia. There's like a little curve a over the foot. Red Sea there. It's because, I'm assuming because you took Multan and that's why? Or no, Mataba? Um, 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 yeah, Mutapa. I took Mutapa, and now it's like, man, where are we going to put this? <laughs> Can't just leave it in the same place. You got like a weird, like, billy hook here. Of a country. You plan on uh, tackling uh, Adal soon? Adal will be next for me. Are they allied with anybody? Nope, that's good. Yeah, they've been, like, completely effed by rebels. Oh, nice. So there should be an easy reabsorption. That's my hope. 
Well, you kind of got like your old your old lands back, pretty much. Right. I was hoping that maybe I could have like one or two peaceful videos. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. I, I don't know who you're asking. I do. <laughs> well, he's my, busy right now. My annexed subjects penalty just went away, and I have 2% to go before annexing my next one. <laughs> it's like, all right, I guess we're just going to have that permanently on forever now. <laughs> yeah, we pretty much usually do. Did you hear the timer that time? Nope. nope. No. Okay, I must have messed with some settings or something because it's being too quiet. Well, oh, it's, it's probably good for your, your overall sound quality. You I still to have to, to the bathroom or something. do something. Like four minutes into the episode, Room is like, oh, the timer went off. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'm ready if you are. Yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And, of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. But for now, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye. See you soon.